is a really, really important event for the students, faculty, and staff here at FIT because we need to raise awareness about domestic violence, whether it be male on male, female on female, male on female. Well, it's definitely important to end violence against men and women. It's a big issue, so that's why we pledged purple. Unfortunately, one in three women are the victims of domestic violence and most women don't report it and it's understandable it's a difficult thing to do to relive such a horrific thing that happened to them this is such a sensitive issue that students really need to know what the guidelines are what help is available that it's okay to speak up and they'll be supported I think it's important because there are people who feel that they can't say anything um, because they're embarrassed and for everyone to come and show that they support this cause is, is them opening up saying, hey, you can talk about this. You can talk about it to me if you don't feel comfortable. We have services on campus to help you out. Sexual assault is a big thing that people are sometimes sometimes hiding, like won't tell that. You won't know that a person is being sexually assaulted or sometimes you don't know if you're, if you're being the, the person that's doing it. It takes a lot of courage when domestic violence or sexual assault has happened to you or a friend to stand up, it's very frightening. So an event like this raises, raises awareness and lets everybody know what's available for them. So we're here to start the conversation and we're here to let people know that there are resources here at FIT. Um, we have tons of information here in terms of support groups, um, hotlines, emergency contact numbers. So the most important advice is you're not alone and to get help either by coming to the counseling center or contacting any of these numbers, reaching out to a friend. We have information here for friends in terms of how to help a friend who may have problems uh, with victimization, rape, domestic violence, that sort of thing. My name is Terry Ginder, I'm director of the counseling center. I think it's very important for everyone to pledge purple today at FIT because domestic violence is worldwide and we would like to make everyone aware of what falls under domestic violence and that there are many, many outreach centers that we can help you. If you need assistance, you can go to EAP or you can go to the Student Counseling Center. Well, it's important because we all need to, not just men and women, all of us need to be educated about sexual violence on college campuses. As you all know, with what's happening now with women across campuses and men, and especially our LGBTQ community, they're all being attacked or violated or victimized. So it's important that we educate ourselves, we let the campus know, we let our faculty know, we know our admins know that we all can be allies in this and that we're all pledging, the, we're all pledging today to be educated and to be aware. We have a, a very good system of like reporting um, just within our system about like letting the resident counselors know, uh, letting your roommates and your parents know whatever's going on in your life. So if instances like this does occur, that you have somebody you can talk to. And there are resources here within the city that people can turn to for help. There is help. You're not alone. And we have representatives here from counseling. Hello, my name is Dr. Susan Breton. I'm from the Counseling Center. Relationships are about love, not hate. Love is understanding, compassion, and communication. I think it's really important to listen to your partner and give your, your partner time to sort of get out what they're trying to say and really listen and hold back a little bit what you're trying to say and have a dialogue. The most important thing is to stay safe. And so the counseling center is here for you if you want to calm it down and, and make an appointment to talk to us or just walk in. We'd be glad to make sure that you're in the right place in a safe place from security, from the NYPD. To be aware of all the risk and dangers of being involved in a domestic violence relationship and to refer friends or family um, so that they can get the help and the services they need. And people are here today, the students are taking a pledge and they're signing this pledge saying that they're going to talk about this issue. They're going to raise awareness among their classmates and they're going to report anything that they know about, or if they see something happening, they're going to step in and try to have it stop. I think domestic violence is something that's important to educate people about, and um, I'm supporting Pledge Purple. If I had a friend that was in an abusive relationship, I would try to counsel them as best I could, and as well as tell them if they would like to go for support services, I will go with them, give them a ride, give them a metro card, meet them before or after the appointment, and support them in any way, shape, or form that I can. If there was a student that was in a situation, I would definitely tell them, one, speak up. 
Don't be a bystander, especially if it's them or into their friends. Go to the dean's office. Go to an administrator. Go to someone that you that cares about you and that supports you. Let you know that you're not alone in this fight. I don't know. It's just important to tell someone that you're there for them no matter what and show their show your support. You hurt my friend. I'm coming after the person. I would definitely want to comfort my friend. Contact the school, the wh whoever I know, like a doctor or anybody. I would definitely try to be at their side and just tell them where they should go for help. Come, I feel like everyone in our community, everyone in the world should feel safe. You should be able to be who you are, to not live in fear. And we just need to have a, a world in the FIT community specifically where all of our students can be who they are freely and safely. We need people to be involved. And we need people to take this pledge. And we're so, so thankful that we have such a great turnout today. Appreciate it.